UK vid comic reviewer here. Um, this is a Beano book from 1986 here. Got Dennis the got the usual characters on there, Minnie the Minks, um, Best Street Kids, and Biffo the Bear there. Roger Dodger is also there. Um, so yeah, let's have a look at this one and see what this one's about. Um, all the characters, all drawings of the characters there. Minnie the Minx drawing them all. Um, Fortunately, this book is not in the best condition, sadly. it's Some of the pages are rather sort of like they're falling out a little bit. So, anyway, you've got Rasha there, which is Dennis the Menace's pig. And Danny from um, the uh, Bass Street Kids decided to paint back Frank Sales on them, which I think they'll probably enjoy because they'll just lick it off. Um, and we've got Cuthbert Cringeworthy out of the Bass Street Kid on a computer. Uh, Minnie the Minx there, uh, bothering her dad as she usually does, um, and eating her dinner rather, rather quickly. Um, and decides to eat some of her dad's dinner as well. Um, and then, then basically clears the table up, puts it in a little bag, and later on decides to water the garden. Um, in actual fact, no, but she's not watering the garden, actually. She's, um, washing the plates that way. Washing, washing the dinner plates that way. Um, her dad decides to have a little kip, and unfortunately, Minnie, trying to be helpful, ends up waking him up and, um, putting him on a line for some reason. I'm not sure, no idea why. Um, her dad obviously isn't too chuffed about that. And, you know, babies, babes, they've got a little babe, baby sort of, um, section in this one. Um, and you've got uh, Minnie the Minx's baby character there using a safety pin to um, to, to make her dad's bottom sore. And you've got Pepper Pony and Lucinda. This was a this was an this was one that often appeared in Beano annuals at the time. Um, a young girl and her horse with a very Afro hairstyle. Um, based, and based, they went on a little adventure. Adventures there, horse drawn carriage. I think she wanted that one to do, but obviously I don't think the horse really liked it. Um, you've got horse box. Um, uh, that girl's po horse po pony um, deciding to beat up a, a, a boxing bag, well then punch bag rather, um, as they often did. <laughs> um, Nasha's Tale, uh, this is a little comic strip about Dennis and Menace's dog Nasha. Um, and, Ni and Nipper also made an appearance, I think, in some of them as well. I don't know if he made an appearance in this one, but um, decides to um, cross a river and um, obviously ends up getting cold and um, ends up sneezing a bone, which happened very, very rarely. And we have Roger the Dodger in a knackered, in a broken, in a um, rather battered old car with no wheels, um, in a scrapyard, um, taking some bits to do some dodges, presumably. Um, so, but this first one actually, um, he actually helps out this lad, this guy, this young lad's father, because this young lad wants a wants a sand pit, and he gives him a nice great big wheel, and the father's very pleased with it, and this gives him some money for it. And um, nice, and he then decides to help himself to a nice cream from this horn on his bike, um, and pops it and gets rather a lot more ice cream. And there's a crow on, over his head. Um, he's got this rearview mirror to see this guy coming up behind him, this bully guy, which is often his rival called Quantra Kerr, I think his name was. And he runs off and um, whacks into a bus stop. And Beano Babies, Roger the Dodger, using a un, using an impromptu sled, sled dog. And the Bass Street Kids, um, basically teacher being un, upset that Cuthbert Cringeworthy won't be in school that day. And the other, the other kids try and help him out to make up for it by buying a pet. Um, so they try and find him one one that they think might like he might like and um, basically it ends up in quite, causing quite a few problems here and 
a crocodile or a snake. What pet shops sell them, I wonder? Well, snakes, I know a lot of pet shops do sell snakes, but crocodiles are not sold very often in them. Might be a bit dangerous. I think the insurance might be a bit high for that. Um, creepy crawlers, doesn't like creepy crawlers apparently. Uh, and there's a parrot there as well. And some goldfish, which they later on decide on. And he takes it to Cuthbert and for a present for um to help him feel better, which the young which the rest of the street kids didn't really like. A horse guard that Pepper's only been up um basically the only keeping guard or something. Um then you've got Smudge, this young guy who's a little bit like Smithy out of um the Beezer, who'd like to get dirty rather a lot. Um and he's you know trying to get into this treacle factory um i can only imagine why um and basically he goes to meet up with this lion who decides to lick him who and it doesn't seem like a very very um dangerous lion and um Wanted to be brave by the looks of it. Anyway, let's go on to another one. This is called Tom, Dick and Sally, which is basically another play on Tom, Dick and Harry and obviously Pop, Dick and Harry out of the Beezer. Um, these two brothers and their sister, often the brothers used to play tricks on the sister and um, she ends up, she used to end up turning the tables on them and they get embarrassed because they're basically playing with dolls by the looks of it. And then we have Ball Boy who... Was a who's the um, footballer, footballer lad, um, and um, trying to. Um, this guy seems to be a bit literal on his thinking of what the um, football, what, what, like footballing type thing. And then you have got the three bears, who are these, these mummy and daddy bear, and this little one, who decide who are often eating and drink, eating and drinking food, but they don't want to. Pay what that guy is wanting for lemonade, which seems to be rather a lot. Um, so they end up playing tu tunes, getting this musician to play tunes to raise up some money, I believe. And um, ends up um, tricking them into giving him drink. Um, so the bears were pretty smart on that one. And you've got Beano Babies, Pa Bear, who Wants a lot of toys. Uh, Little Plum, the Native American lad, um, meeting up with an with a, with an ape, and basically deciding to be posh English guys, which was interesting and very very cool, I find. Uh, Billy Wiz, the young lad who can run faster than Usain Bolt, um, be trying to. Got running through the countryside, try and set a fastest time by the looks of it. Oh, actually, he's um, he's won a country contest thing. Um, Pup Parade, the Bash Street Kids dogs, um, looking um, trying to make themselves quite strong to compete with other dogs and be as strong as them, but end up getting. Eating rather a lot instead. <laughs> and you got Pepper Pony again, doing st helping her with her stamp collection. Lord Snooty, that rich young lad who and his family, um, looking sort of like they're doing some Olympic type sports there, um, which is interesting. And then you've got, and then also he decides to trick them all so he can. Have some of the food instead, and you've got Beano Babes, Lord Snooty, in the, just rowing around in a hat in a bath. Ball boy again, the footballing lads. Um, trying to get into a football match, by a little bit, and um, ending up washing up, but they can watch. So they, but they can watch the football at the same time. And Dennis and Mason Asher, good old Dennis, the the um. Main stay of the Beano. Um, with Salt Water Softy um, deciding he doesn't like the sound of the gun. And uh, 
some entering some sort of dog con dog trials contest, um, and getting the sheep to follow Nasha dressed disguised as a sheep, um, and herding themselves, which I think people were getting a bit suspicious about. And Dennis wins a prize, and it turns out that they put in a sheep dick, and it turns out to be Nasha. So the parents and the so his mum and dad and the organisers weren't too chuffed about that. And Dennis, the menace, and Nasha are on. Um, basically getting some mice to um, give him a nice, comfortable, privileged life, by the looks of it. And fun on the cards, Dennis the Menace again. Um, and um, all the softy playing cards together. Um, playing Snap with a crocodile. Um, and um, obviously, Ward well, decides he does, gets upset and doesn't want to play anymore. So he ends up, so then he tends to almost play 50, decides to. Do a, do a game of 52 card pickup, and his dad obviously not too chuffed about it. And um, obviously, Nasha getting the post in those ones. And Dennis, Nasha beating Dennis in a race. Rasha, Dennis's pig, um, going, trying to get into his dinner, but obviously, there's skiing contests going on. And in the end, Rasha gets a load of food um, to help out at this restaurant. Uh, you've got Babyface Finderson, this young baby-faced, baby-faced thief who likes to steal things. Um, he often used to cross over in a few comics, a couple of other comics as well. And um, the policeman was on holiday with him as well and captures him in this in this digger. Uh, Bass Street Kids again. Uh, um, trying to get hold of some conkers to have a conker fight, but the squirrels decide they don't want that. So they decide to make their own conkers by the looks of it. And Smithy, not the um, Beezer one, but their Beano guy, decides to get a balloon one and wins the conker contest. Um, so he actually outwits them there. Beano babies, teacher, and the kids' parents. Okay, as as a, as predicted. Um, Smudge, that dad who has to get dirty again. Looks like he's having dinner or some dinner there and doing a motorbike race and getting dirtier and um, wet at the end of it. Um, there's a seahorse. Seahorse obviously not liking the sea. Um, Billy Wiz not running too fast on ice there and in snow, so that obviously even slows him down. Um, so, yeah. But he actually finds a way of um, keeping warm and... Um, Running without too many problems. You know, babies, Billy Wiz. You know, running a Greyhound. I wonder, I wonder if anyone had any money on him. You've got Pup Parade, the um, Bass Street Kids dogs again. Um, going over a wall and stealing bones. And then you've got Beano TV, um, some TV programs with all of the characters in. Um, uh, Smithy trying to help that golf golfer guy in. Um, and you've got Roger the Dodger again, the dodgy character like um, Tricky Dicky. Um, he basically, so his parents decide they're going to play play with him instead and um, can't play with his friends. So he decides to have some fun with them, um, with a dog as well. Um, and his parents decide, and he ends up wearing his pair, and his parents decide to... Um, have a rest and um, get Roger doing everything for them. And uh, Rasher again, eating out of a trough. Um, me and the Minks um, at a craft club there, got, um, helping her dad out. Um, not in not in the ways he fought either. And um, these women came, these women coming round for a sort of afternoon tea or something, and um, ending up crashing through into this through this chair and. Minnie decided to help out with some clothing. Moe's horse, that pony again. Um, then you've got Ball Boy who plays football and ends up putting a ball in his mum's jelly. Little Plum again, the Native American lad. Um, and there's a baby as well. And the three bears again. And you've got Tom, Dick and Sally flying kites. Um, with Tom and Dick having food on their faces, uh, Lord Snowy Beano babies again. Um, and so basically that's all, just quickly go through, there's not much else there. Um, anyway, take care, bye bye now.